हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल ऑन पेरल स्मार्ट वर्ल्ड एंड दिस इज पेरल सो एज अ टूरिस्ट और ट्रैवलर व्हेन यू कम टू अ न्यू सिटी व्हाट कम्स टू योर माइंड इज टू बाय सुविनियर्स एंड सो राइट नाउ आई एम एट दिस प्लेस वेयर दे हैव लॉट्स ऑफ सुविनियर्स एंड आई विल शो यू व्हिच इज द प्लेस व्हाट आर थिंग्स दे हैव एंड आल्सो हाउ इट्स मेड इजंट दैट अमेजिंग फॉलो मी सो गाइस इफ यू लाइक माय कंटेंट please do like and subscribe because when you do that as i said it gives me an encouragement please do it now so guys right now i am at the post office and this is the shop number 19 and i'll show you so come let's go inside so this is the shop and these are all the things they have so this is the crockery and can you see it has ethiopian print on it isn't that beautiful oh look at those glasses it's nice If you are a coffee lover I'm sure you would like this So this pieces are made from the wood and it is natural they have not painted it and also it's called ebony that means it's from ebony wood and they have just polished it but they have used no colors this is a natural wooden artifact as a show piece So this is like a violin but it's a local one which is called krar and this is how we have to hold it and this is how you play it <laughs> i don't know how to play it but then at least you can hear the sound <laughs> So they have lots of things from artifacts to show pieces from candle holder to the jewelry boxes as you can see these are the candle holders Even this amazing I have bought this No, this is not as a souvenir, but for myself. Maybe I can drink the juice, and this I can use as a keychain. So, guys, this is the souvenir shop, and now I will show you about the cultural dolls and how it is made. So, come. These are the cultural Ethiopian dolls made by hand and it depicts the unique culture of Ethiopia. These are the traditional Ethiopian dolls which is beautifully handcrafted using all local resources like cotton, clay, newspaper, wool thread, metal and so on.
Wow, she wrapped newspaper so that it gives a structure to the body. I am amazed to see how things are being built and constructed to make a beautiful motif and I am sure this requires lots of patience. It's so fascinating to see that everything is brought together using the local resources. So for now he is using wet mud clay to build the motif and he will make a hen. It's amazing. This reminded me of a beautiful quote I read somewhere that you just need to be creative and that all the resources we need are in the mind. So next time when you are in Ethiopia, don't forget to help them grow by buying these beautiful dolls as souvenirs. And now you know how it's made with lots of patience and love. So guys, it was fun watching them making the cultural dolls. Indeed, Ethiopians are very creative and artistic by nature. They use their limited resources and make such a beautiful creation. So thank you so much for watching my vlog. 
I hope you like my content and if you do, please do like and subscribe as I said.